Hey, Mark, I was uh, told for the 22nd time in his career, Steph hits 10 or more threes in a game. When he's can't seem to miss like that, how tough is that on a team to try to defend? I mean, he's he puts a ton of pressure. Even if he starts the game 0 for 5, you know, the pressure that he puts on you just with how he moves and what you know he's capable of, um, that's the issue. That's what opens everything up for them. Um, you know, he had it going tonight. I thought there were some where we had, we could have controlled it a little bit more with our pressure on him and making him drive. But uh, some of those are just tough. You got to tip your hat. Um, and obviously we didn't do enough tonight. He was excellent. Their team was very good. Paris Lawson with OKCThunder.com. Hey, Coach, we've talked to you about him before. Um, just wanted to ask you about Kenrich and the boost that he was able to give you guys, especially early on, seven points kind of in that first half. What did you see from him and kind of what he was able to do after not playing um, the game before? Yeah, I mean, he was he's ready to compete as always. You know, that's his, that's his calling card at this point. Um, you know, he brought great toughness to the game and gave us good energy in that first half especially and then finished the game the right way. Um, you know, he just continues to be – unbelievably consistent and reliable regardless of what we ask him to do, what role, what position. Um, you know, he's been impressive and tonight was no different. Nick Gallo with Thunder Broadcasting. Obviously, it's very early, Mark, but one thing I've just been tracking with with Gabby, I think he's got 15 assists and only two turnovers so far for a guy that's never played in the NBA, never played with any of these guys. Uh, does that strike you as as impressive or do you see any reason why he's – been able to be so strong with the ball. Yeah, he's impressive there. You know, he's he plays the right way. You know, that's the simplest way to put it. He plays a great toughness, you know, especially on the defensive end and physicality. He's not afraid to stick his nose in there. And then offensively, uh, he's going to make the right play, you know, nine out of ten times or more. And uh, I think the assist to turnover is just a byproduct of that. He's a very, very reliable player. Uh, and that's how he is from the get-go. So, you know, as he continues to acclimate, um, and, and get with our guys, you know, hopefully we're able to unlock a little bit more of that, but he's made a good first impression, like I've mentioned before. Harry Trammell with the Oklahoman. Yeah, Mark, are you guys bussing over to Sacramento? We are. Yep, we're bussing there right after the game here. That's a, you know, that's a lot longer bus ride than most teams take in the NBA. What will you do on the bus ride? Will you if this game, go through the you know, watch it on your iPad or will you try to re, you know, sort of get free of it? Um, no, I'll watch the game. You know, our staff will watch the game. We have a process that we follow that we'll do on the plane. Um, you know, I'll watch the game. Sometimes I'll journal, I'll call my wife, wake her. Um, and if I have extra time, I'll give you a call and you can help me kill some time. <laughs> 